Around 11.15 this morning, Valley residents might have heard a roar overhead as the United States Air Force Thunderbirds, the world's premier aerial demonstration team, arrived at Youngstown Air Reserve Station. Thunder Over the Valley Week officially began yesterday with the arrival of Thunderbird 8, who performed an aerial survey of the show grounds. The Thunderbirds are headlining the air show and open house, the first since the Thunderbirds performed at the 2009 show. U.S. Air Force Reserve Major Caroline Jensen flies the number three right wing Thunderbird. As a Thunderbird, she represents the entire Air Force, but as an Air Force reservist, her role in the air show has a special meaning to the more than 1,600 citizen airmen assigned to Youngstown Air Reserve Station. Well, I think it's really amazing. So the Thunderbirds are 120 people, but we represent the 675,000 people who serve in the Air Force, whether it's as a civilian or active duty or in the Guard or in the Reserve. Um, so it's really special for me to be a part of a team that that uh, represents that, and it's great to come to a base. Even though I haven't been here before, I kind of feel like I'm home here at a reserve base. Jensen, an Air Force Academy graduate, began her aviation career by piloting gliders there. She has served as a combat pilot in Iraq and has more than 3,300 flying hours. She was inspired to become a pilot and Air Force officer by watching the Thunderbirds perform when she was a child. Oh, the, easily the absolute best part of this job is meeting kids and talking to kids because I was that 13 year old kid who saw the Thunderbirds fly and uh, it sparked a dream and a goal within me that led me to here and I've done a lot of great things along the way too and I really want to inspire and have somebody walk up to me someday and say hey I saw you fly with the Thunderbirds and now I'm in the Air Force because of something that you did. Thunder Over the Valley 2014, the first air show in Youngstown since 2009, is scheduled for May 17th and 18th. Visit www.thunderovervalley.com for information on busing and transportation, schedule and times, security, and other critical information. Reporting for the 910th Airlift Wing Public Affairs Office, I'm Public Affairs Specialist Eric White.